First off, the chest is made up of, in majority, a fan-like muscle group called the pectoralis major. The striated bands from this muscle begin at the sternum and they end off at the humerus, connecting all this together. And the group can further be broken down into parts by location of its various heads. We have the sternocostal head, the clavicular head, and the abdominal head. These parts work in tandem together to bring those arms inwards at the shoulders for large outward pushing movements. Underneath the pectoralis major, we have the pectoralis minor, which is a thin triangular muscle that works alongside of its major partner. These are both innervated by the medial and lateral pectoral nerve, and they're known when grouped together as the lateral anterior thoracic nerve. Wait, don't go just yet. If you like this video and would like to see more, subscribe to our YouTube channel and visit our website to access more great, easy to follow videos. Don't worry, Nursing Study Buddy will be posting free videos for our YouTube subscribers and a wide variety of snippets from our video library at nursingstudybuddy.com. Nursing Study Buddy was designed for those nursing students and current nursing students who are struggling with their educational experience. So if you're a pro, whiz, Einstein, or even Stephen Hawking's nephew and have no trouble studying and acing your tests and quizzes, nursingstudybuddy.com is not for you. With new videos being added every week, what are you waiting for? Visit nursingstudybuddy.com and sign up for a one day free trial and put some free time back in your life by cutting down your study time while improving your test scores. We'll see you there.